Hi, welcome back to Bird Morsels. Today I will be talking about finches. Many species of finches live in m much of North America. The house finch was originally a bird only of the West, but it was introduced into New York, and from there it has spread across the eastern half of the continent. It can be seen throughout all of its range during the whole year. The red crossbill, which during the summertime is a bird of only the far north, might come further south during the winter. These movements are called eruptions. The red crossbill is very eruptive. And it go and in years when pine cones are scarce, it will come much further south than it usually does. In other years, it stays in the far north. It has a close relative, the white-winged crossbill, which may be occasionally seen also. The common red pole is another eruptive finch that of the far north. It comes further south in some years than it does in others because its it seeds and its, its main food source, when there is a shortage of them, it will come south and will be seen at bird feeders if you offer seed during the fall and winter. It also has a close, less commonly seen relative, the hoary red pole. It can may be hard to distinguish these. So if you see a, a strange whiter bird mixed in with the red poles at your feeder, it may be a hoary red pole. Pine siskin of northern forests is also eruptive in some years. Th these years are when its main food sources fail and it can often be seen at seed feeders in the northern part of the continent. The evening grass beak is one more eruptive finch of the north. It is easily distinguished by its striking plumage, male striking plumage, and large yellow bill. It is also eruptive, but is usually seen further south than other northern finches are. The purple and cassins finches are close relatives of the house finch. The purple finch lives in the east and the cassins in the west, but they can be very hard to distinguish. Sometimes the purple is eruptive. But usually it stays in its normal range. The American goldfinch is found all over the continent. During the winter, it molts to a duller brown plumage. The Lawrence's goldfinch is mostly found in California, so the lesser goldfinch also lives in the southwest, and it may have either a green back or a dark back. Thank you for watching Bird Morsels and come back again soon.